Weston is here from DA Davidson. We're talking about market news, and I hear there was finally some good news for the market. There was, yeah. We finally saw a little bit of a relief. We saw the Dow was up 200 points, 208 after four days selling. S&P was up 28 after selling off for five days, and the NASDAQ was up 122. And it's really been hit because tech stocks have really been hit hard really showed up in the NASDAQ. So that, that uh, little bit of relief there helped yesterday. Unfortunately, uh, pre-market, the NASDAQ's looking to get hit again because there's some weak earnings in, in a couple tech stocks. So Dow's open and 100 down at this point. And so. what was it that changed the mood of the investors? Well, we got a rumor yesterday that uh, the tariff talk with China uh, was was going to be backed off a little bit. That rumor was later retracted. They said, no, we didn't say that. But but Trump meets with the, the Chinese leaders later this month. They're hoping that we can get some resolution there because if not, in January, we see another 10 to 25% tariff increases. And so the hope is that, that we see that kind of paired back uh, after their meeting. So we'll kind of have to watch until January. And last, I hear that there were some good numbers for the um, economic numbers as well. Yeah, there was. Actually, uh, before I go that, you know, the Brickset deal is still uh, an issue, uh, and the Fed chairman is also um, dealing with, with, with what's going on there. He's liking what he sees in the economy, um, but says it's going to be measured. But yeah, we did. We saw first time unemployment numbers were good again. Mm -hmm. uh, the Philly Fed index dropped. That's good. Uh, Empire State Index rose, that's, that's their manufacturing index. And then retail sales jumped in October. So mm -hmm. we're heading into Christmas. Yeah. That's obviously gonna be good. The economy is strong, so they're anticipating a better retail season. So mm -hmm. uh, the big question is, will it be online or will it be brick and mortar? So mm -hmm. um, most brick and mortars have a big online presence now, so they're hoping that, that uh, across the board we see strong retail numbers. Mm -hmm. Well, I just did my first bit of holiday shopping online yesterday, so I contribute to online. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you're not alone. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much for being here Absolutely. with us. Absolutely, and go Grizz. Yeah, I knew you were going to go there. <laughs> we'll be right back after this break.